Malaysia needs to break away from the long-time trap of middle-income nation through the adoption of science and technology. Energy, Technology, Science, Climate Change and Environment Minister Yeo Bi In opened the China Smart Industry Trade Exhibition in Kuala Lumpur on Saturday. If today you look at the economic structure of Malaysia, we are what we call uh, trapped trap in the middle, middle income trap. What happened to our economic structure is this, is that we have grown our economy on cheap labour, cheap capital and uh, cheap uh, 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 raw materials. But we have never been able to get out from it because of the lack of adoption of science and technology. If we would like to aspire to be a high income nation, this is the one thing we need. The enabler for us for more income is not cheaper labour. The enabler for us to get more income is not cheaper capital. The enabler for us to get more income and become a developed nation is the adoption of science and technology. It's the advancement in our research and development. Yo said artificial intelligence or AI is one of the ministry's focus next year. She also said the ministry has earmarked the phase three of Technology Park Malaysia to be an AI park. China's ambassador to Malaysia, Bai Tian, was also present at the event. China's在智能科技产业也具备先发的优势。目前，据我所知，中国不少智能科技产业公司已经进入马来西亚的市场，积极参与马来西亚各类高科技产业合作平台和项目的扩建升级，为中马合作开辟了新的天地。可以说，当